In this video, I show you how to insert pivot table slicers like this so you can filter your data with just the click of a button. I'm Casper from Spreadsheeto and here I have a pretty standard pivot table. A slicer is a great way to filter this pivot table. So I'm gonna show you how in three simple steps. The first step is to select your pivot table and go to the pivot table analyze tab and insert the actual slicer from here. The next step is to choose what you want to filter in the slicer. And that's actually a pretty important decision. That could be anything that you can see in the slicer, but it could also be on data that is not shown in the pivot table right now. So in this case, I wanna filter on the region column from the original data set, but it's not shown here as you can see. So I want to be able to filter on that. That's a great addition to this pivot table. So hit region and now you can see your slicer like this. Now it works right now, but step number three is to actually modify this a bit so it looks something like what I showed you in the beginning. First, I wanna change how these buttons are structured. So go up here in the slicer tab that appears when you select your slicer and change the number of columns like this, for example. Then I wanna put it somewhere where it makes sense. That could be right here. So I'm gonna change drag the edges here and change this. Also, this region header takes up way too much space. That's totally unnecessary. So I'm gonna go into the slicer settings and choose not to display the header like this. And maybe I need another column here for this to make sense. Like this, super cool. That's actually the slices I want to insert here. Now I can click these buttons to filter the data super easily like this. I can also hold down control to select multiple of these like that. If you want to learn more Excel, please check out my free online Excel training at spreadsheeto.com slash YouTube. But if you want to stay here on YouTube, YouTube has actually handpicked this video for you and I have handpicked actually this video right here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.